friendly greetings. I highly, highly recommend that you save snapshots of your second life. And here's why. Because when you look back at all the happy memories you had in world, you will smile and feel so contented and so thankful that you took them. And you can share them with loved ones and friends too. It's very easy. First of all, what you see is what you get if you have a scene like this, okay? And then you can reposition the camera if you prefer view menu and the camera controls move it around like that, like so. Once you're happy with that, then go to file menu and snapshot to disk, okay? The first time you do that in the session, then it'll ask you to save it. It saves here on Windows as a bitmap file and go ahead and save it. You can see I have hundreds because I love taking cap capturing my memories. There we go. And the subsequent times you do it during that time you're logged in, it won't ask you until the next time you're logged in. If you want more options, then you can go to the file menu and take snapshot or right here in your toolbar, the snapshot button. And here we have a lot of stuff. If you think that's too confusing, click less to minimize. You can see it's a little preview and you have all these choices of extra sorts of things you'd want. But let's just go to less for now, keep it simple, refresh the snapshot, and then we can go ahead and then we can save it. And just like that, our memory is captured. And then you can open it up in the standard graphics editing program and modify it further if you want, send it, and share it like I said. Now, this is just scratching the surface, and I have a great snapshot tips help guide all prepared for you to check out. If you want to learn more about advanced photography voodoo, like advanced menu, high-res snapshot, what does that do? It's quite a snapshot, it's a disk, and all that good stuff. Check it out.